Okay, guys, here we have an atomic bomb bath bomb. This is watermelon. Let me quickly grab the tag. It was wrapped up in this. Here is the logo. Please don't mind my purple hand. I am dyeing my hair in another crazy color. Her tags always have her logo on the front, showing you that it is a bubbly bomb. All the information on the inside, and even directions on how to use on the back. So, very cool. Um, yes, my hand is purple. Yes, I am dyeing my hair a wacky color, and uh, I got it everywhere. So, please don't, don't mind that. Let's throw this bad boy in, and let's see what happens. I am more than happy to do atomic bomb demos. They are beautiful shows, amazing products. The smell on this is not synthetic at all. Usually when you get like a watermelon bath bomb, you get that more of that candy watermelon smell. This thing smells like an actual real slice of watermelon. I wanted to bite it. Boogie wanted to bite it. <laughs> <clears throat> I let Boogie smell it, and Boogie went to eat it. Doesn't say much for Boog though, because Boogie eats everything. Leave my son alone. <laughs> Wow, Rich, look, 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 look at the color, look at the color. Oh, wow, that smells. Smell it? Spinning. You smell it? Yeah. Okay. Uh, also, what I'm trying out tonight is the coffee soap. I am so excited to try the coffee soap. Um, I have a massive migraine right now, just uh, from not sleeping properly. And then when you do get some chance to sleep, you oversleep and you get that bad headache. So I'm going to pop open that coffee soap with that nice freshening coffee scent. And uh, scrub down with that, and uh, then go use my uh, two bombs that she made me. Cool. Uh, I'm going to use the cooling one for the uh, migraine. And I'm going to rub the rest of the, the warming and the cooling on my back as usual. I am like, I'm getting low on that stuff, man. I use it constantly. I do enjoy my atomic bomb products. Um, they really are my holy grail. Wow. Wow, look! Look, 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 it's giving us the paint, it's giving us the paint. I love that, I love it. I love the creamy frothiness on the top. Oh my lord. It just, it, oh man, it makes you feel so like, it's such a luxury bomb that it just makes you feel like you're slipping into cream with it. And it is one of the most moisturizing bombs I have ever used. Her bombs have the highest moisture content content in the world without feeling greasy. Like, uh, I've used other companies that felt greasy, but were very moisturizing, and then left you feeling kind of slick and gross afterwards. Uh, especially for a woman that has a cat in the house. You know, I don't want to feel greasy and, you know, have the cat claw jump up on me and poof. It's all over my skin, your hair. It's gross. Nasty. Yeah. Oh my god, I love it. I love the pink and the green, the lime green coming out on it. It's so beautiful. Look at it. It does have shimmer to it. Our water, let me show you the water back here. Our water is a gorgeous pinkish, purplish, hot pinkish color. These bombs are beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. You guys want to laugh? Look at my hand. <laughs> I have dyed the shit out of myself. But y'all will see later how, uh, how it comes out. I hope it comes out. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I got my evening cigarette. Richie's getting ready to head off to work, so I gotta do the bath quick. And, uh, whoa. Yeah. That's beautiful. I almost fell in the tub. Yeah. <laughs> Could you just imagine that if I was on camera and then I fell in the tub and so did you? Like the national videos or whatever it is. <laughs> Richie said he would have turned it into America's Funniest Home Videos. The YouTuber that slipped off and fell in the tub. You know, I've done that before. I've actually sat on the edge and ran a bath and was talking to my brother on the phone with my headphones. And uh, all of a sudden, you hear, ah! and then my phone went underneath the water and I picked it back up and my headphones didn't work no more, but my phone worked perfectly fine. I picked my phone up and I said, oh my God, did you hear that? And he thought I dropped the baby in, so he started screaming. And uh, I said, Ryan, 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 it's okay, it's okay. It was just me. It was my fat ass that went in. It was so funny, though. He laughed so hard when he realized that it was just me. Look how beautiful that is. Okay, let's get the whole shot of the foaming aspect. Look at that. Look at the pink and the green still in the foam. That is amazing. Look, 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 look. 
I love these man bombs. Her and Bomb Diggy put on the best shows in the world, man. I know I love my other uh, bombs. I love Porcelain Wolf because they put on cool shows with their cool embeds and things like that. Uh, I just don't like that chunky red glitter that's in them. But I still love them. And the Countess was my favorite from Porcelain Wolf. But these two companies, Atomic Bomb and Bomb Diggy, are such showmen when it comes down to their product that you just, you, you have to, you have to buy them. You have to. They are such beautiful bombs. How could you not fall in love with that right now? I mean, I'm just... Oh my god, look at the watercolor. Now, for you, you guys are seeing more of a morphe pink, like morphish color. I'm seeing a hot morphish color. So it does have like that hot pink and that natural smell of watermelon in it and extremely moisturizing. Look. I can even like start to build up like a lather in my hand. That's so cool. I love that. Okay, guys, you ready for the uh, the fi the final finale here? Wait, let me do it. Let me do it. Okay. Oh, it's so beautiful. I don't want to do it. Okay, ready, Funk? Did it. This one's hard to do though. Crush my atomic bomb. <laughs> look, look how pretty. Look, my hand is foaming. Look, look, look. Oh, my purple dye all over it. I went like blue, purple, pink. I, I went nuts, man. I don't know what the hell happened because towards the end I just smeared it all in my head. All right, let's go. This is the best part of the whole bath. A luxury bath, one bear farm, three things happening here. We get our bath melt feel, our beautiful show and scent, our gorgeous color with some shimmery glitter through, and we get bubbles! And every time your bubbles will die down, flip your water on again, they come right back. You don't just get a froth, you actually get a bubble. These are bubbling bath bombs. She actually does a bubbling bath bomb. Look at that. I can just agitate this a little bit. I can run the water. It is a bubbling bath bomb. And it leaves you with like the creamiest, frothiest bubble. It's like cream on the top. I love it. You can agitate. You can do the water, just run it. You got a beautiful bath here. I'm really, really, really pleased with everything I've ever bought from her. So your best bet to hit that drop box down below, click on either her Facebook page or her Etsy shop and contact her. What I do with her is I tell her, I have a hundred bucks, go nuts. This is what I would like. Add in a few things that I like, maybe a bling bomb. I really do love the bling bombs and they're mammoth. Okay, I don't want to build up bubbles too high simply because Boogie is going to eat them. And this one is basically a bath for bugs. I mean, me and bugs, but really I want to, I want to wash bugs up real quick. But look at that. You get everything in this bomb. Everything. The water is so soft and so silky. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. It's so soft, so silky. You get all the bubbles on the top here. You, I can build them up extremely high, as if I had a bubble bar in here. I have done it for you guys in the past, so you guys can take a look at it. But there you have it. That is our one bath bomb that gives us three opponents. It gives us the scent show, it gives us the bath melt, and it gives us the bubble bar feel. So this is a lu lu definitely a luxury bath. Right here. Your beautiful luxury bath, your beautiful bubbles. Look at that water. ain't it? And to top it all off, I have my juicy fruit bubble dough. I'm running low on my bubble dough though. I'm getting down about halfway through my bubble dough. <laughs> I love that stuff. The bubble dough is amazing. It's a bubble bath dough. She makes one kind in bubble gum and you can request, you know, whatever scent or anything like that. Uh, when she was making mine, she made a video. So this way I can watch her make my dough. 
She loaded it up in the glitter that I asked for. She basically did everything I asked for. No matter what it was, even if she said, you really want to put glitter in this and scrub bugs and glitter? I said, yes. Even though she was a little leery on it, she went for it. She did exactly what I asked. Everything that I wanted, she did. She made me some beautiful glittered bath bombs. Um, the actual atomic bomb. Holy cow. That, okay, she custom made that for me. So that was custom just for me. It was all mine. Uh, I'm sure she would custom make it for you. <laughs> But it is amazing, man. I am so excited. Now, not only do I have my bubble dough, but I also have my coffee soap. So the bubble dough is just for me and Bugs to play with. And then once Bugs gets out, I'm going to coffee soap it up. And this soap is the only soap that I can wash my face with and not have any problems whatsoever. No stinging, no burning. With a lot of Lush products, I can wash my face and it either stings, burns, or leaves me feeling oily. Her products leave me feeling clean, calmed, soft. My skin does not burn. I don't have any issues whatsoever. So guys, I'm going to jump in here and I'm going to enjoy my bath. And uh, I hope you guys can pop on, talk to Tammy, who is the owner of Atomic Balm Bath and Body. I have her links down below of how to contact her. Uh, I like the way I do it. I just tell her I have $100, I have $50. I would like to have a bling bomb in there. I would like to have some bubble dough. Work your magic. And I, she, she works magic. She is a bath bomb whisperer. She is the bath bomb god. She can work unbelievable magic. She cleared up stuff that dry patches on my face. I've had a few of them for years and doctors couldn't clear them up. And then her whole homemade lotion did it. I use it every night, the same way I use the creams from the doctors, and it was fine. I had a chemical burn on my face, even my scarring is going away. I'm blown away. I love Tammy's product. I, when I talk to Boog about, let's go take a Tammy bath, we call it Aunt Tammy. Because Boogie is going to grow up to learn that Aunt Tammy is always going to be a staple in our life because she makes his bath products. So we have Aunt Tammy, and then from Bomb Diggy, we have Aunt Jamie. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, most definitely, I do get attached to my bomb creators, and I do enjoy using a small company so that way I can have these people in my life, and I know exactly who is creating the products that I am bathing my very precious miracle baby in. Because I couldn't have children after cancer and getting rid of an ovary and then going through breast cancer. They told me no children, and Boogie popped up. So this is my angel. My literal miracle angel that popped up out of the blue. <laughs> At a very late age in my life. I wouldn't have had children anymore. I was, what was like, 33? 30, yeah. I was 33, turning 35. No, I was 34, getting ready to turn 35. No way in hell. And why was I going to have any more children? So I'm very, very odd about what I'm going to put my baby in. I love the fact that Tammy's stuff, I know what she's putting in. I've watched her make them. You can watch her channel. You can see everything, and she actually will go on and tell me everything that's in them. And she'll tell me if, you know, if on another bomb, if something might not be too safe to, to watch out for. Because if I have, you know, something allergic, because I'm allergic to everything, that, you know, it could be the cause. Just watch. Like, she, she answers every question. She's an amazing woman. And I trust my child's skin with her completely. Same thing with Bomb Diggy. Jamie is very much, she'll tell you everything. Uh, she knows that I have a grape allergy. The both They both do. They both know I have a grape allergy, so they try and stay away from a lot of the uh, grape oils and things like that and use more high-quality stuff. Because as they use in all their products, it's high-quality stuff. But they know the grapeseed oil uh, will cause me itchiness and discomfort. And uh, they know. So they know me. And that's what I like. I like that, you know, these people know me. And I can tell them anything I want. I cannot call Lush and say, I have a grape allergy and I'm afraid of the grapeseed oil. Can you maybe not use it? I can't do that with Lush, unfortunately. I can't do that with Moon's Harvest either. You know, I mean, it, there's, you know, Fortune Cookie Soaps. I really can't do it with them. Which Baby Soap, she has her line already created, you know, like this. When you go with the smaller, smaller companies, the indie companies, you can request customs, things like that. Um, you know, I mean, between Tammy and Jamie with Bomb Diggy and Atomic Bomb, I have never been treated more like like a family member than I have in my life with a company. This is very un unusual for me to be treated like family. And that they actually care about my son. They care about, you know, what I'm putting my son in and things like that. So that's why I trust them to make all my products. And uh, yeah, I love them for it. I love them for the care that they put into these products to make sure that everyone is happy and everyone is treated good. And it doesn't matter who you are, a YouTuber, a non-YouTuber, your products are coming in just as beautiful as mine are, and my products are coming in just as beautiful as a massive YouTubers are. So, there's no, no discrepancy there whatsoever. 
Okay, uh, Tammy, I love you. I'm gonna go take a bath in your bomb right now. And I'm gonna build up some little more bubbles. <laughs> so, I'm jumping in, guys. I love you all. I will talk to you again later. I have another video planned for later. And you're gonna get a sneaky peek at some of my collection. And, uh, yeah. That's basically it. So, uh, happy bathing. And if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Flick your notifications on so that way you can see the next bomb and the next company we use. Or, you know, next giveaways or anything else that we do here. And uh, if you enjoyed seeing the Atomic Bomb Watermelon Bath Bomb go off, hit that thumbs up and let me know. So that way, when you hit the thumbs up, you let me know what type of videos you enjoy more. And then I put more of those on. I know everybody enjoys the Lush. I know, I know, I know. But how many times can you demo the same old Lush products over and over and over again? And when I order from the kitchen, I mainly order the gels and jellies, things like that. Once in a while I get a bomb. Uh, it's kind of hard because <clears throat> uh, some of their bombs do not put on shows. They just kind of go off. So, I like doing the ones that are, uh, that show off. You know, I would rather have a bomb that does, you know, that showboats than a bomb that is just white. Ah, there's a kitten biting me! Oscar is biting me! He's on my ankle! <laughs> Alright, I love you guys! Um, yes, you know something? Maybe later on, uh, tomorrow morning, I will do an Oscar update so you guys can see how cool he is and what he's doing and that he plays and he's awesome now. But, uh, and he's biting the crap out of me. Oh my god. He's, yeah, he plays too much. Uh, <laughs> alright, love you all. Talk to you later. Bye!